That's right, dude. Voted most handsome and mommy and daddy are getting ready to go vote too. Did you know that today we're choosing a new president? Uh-huh, it's for me. No, it's for our country. In this together. Good morning guys, we're getting ready to drop Abram off at school. We've really told our kids like next to nothing about this upcoming election. Symphony a little bit because she's older and she kind of understands and. to wait and vote when both of the kids were out of school just to, you know, be more involved and... Hey, Miss Mary. I'm vlogging. <laughs> Did you meet Miss Mary today at the bank? Hmm. I'm home now. And I have an Abram and a sleeping little bunny. And I have party supplies. Check it out, you guys. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. We're having party tonight. It started out really small and intimate just with one of Sam's brothers and one of his sisters and we realized oops we planned it on GC night so contacted our GC leaders and invited everyone. They took us up on the offer and so we'll see how it turns out. Hey babe. He's on a babe. Hey honey. Whoa, whoa. Hey honey. <laughs> whoa, whoa. It is finally that time we are off to go vote as a family. Mia's coming with the baby. Um, so basically today is about, Mommy, are we going to get worse or worst, you know? I'm still unsure as to who I'm going to vote for, if I'm going to do an independent party or, yeah, I'm not, I'm not going to get political. I'm really nervous, I felt so confident about who I was going to put on the ballot, and now I'm here, I'm like, whoa. Well, We're big kids! We're big kids! We love you! <laughs> There's only a few things that's more patriotic than voting, and of course, enlisting into the military and fighting for your country is definitely the most. But voting is definitely at the top of the list. At least for us citizens who sit around and just raise families, you know? Okay, okay, we're getting somewhere now, silverware. Got our little photo booth section ready. Red, white, and blue Oreos. I love it. It looks so cute. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one. Happy New Year's! Oh. Go, guys! I got a boo-boo! decision desk can at long last. Whoa, look at me, Dad! Whoever wins the presidency in Ohio apparently has always won the election. I didn't know that little fact until like two seconds ago when Sam told me, so... Whoa. A Republican has never won the presidency without also winning Ohio. The electoral vote for Ohio. Hey, our first guests are here right in time for Ohio to be announced. I love friend, sister. Are you her sister? Best friend. Best friend. Y'all look alike. What's up, Mikey? What's up, bro? Oh, man, this is going to explode on me. Cool. Do it. Let's see it. Do it, Mr. Porter. Do it, man. Do it for the vlog. Oh, my God. <laughs> what is happening in here? We're having, we're having fun. You guys are destroying Evan. <laughs> oh, my God. Matt, you guys on the Trump train say choo choo! <laughs> I'm not on the Trump train. I know you're not. Mike, choo choo! Choo choo what? You on the Trump train? Um, it's a secret. Can I get a choo choo up in here? Choo choo! What is that? Trump train. Trump train. Oh. 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 Sixth graders, they had registered everybody to vote and they came around with iPads. That's awesome. And the kids each got to cast their ballot. Mm -hmm. And I think yeah. Trump got like 377 and Hillary's 209. I got it. That's hilarious. And Three, two. I got a two! Here go, baby. Here go, baby. Yeah. Boop. <laughs> Boop. Kind of strategy. What are you trying to get? Piece of cake. That whole piece? Oh, wait. <laughs> I said that's a big piece. Do you want a piece? Sure, I'll take this one. Thanks. Here you go. One for you. One for you. One, one, one. 
Here you go, buddy. That's candy. He he changes dirty clothes. People who love each other as fellow believers, but also love and honor and seek to respect our enemies, those who will not show us love in return. That we live in a kingdom that you run as the sovereign ruler. Thank you, Lord, that you two thousand years ago. What's the cool kids doing? I'm trying to do work. This here. Like work the cool kids are doing work. Yeah, I'm doing my I don't know that's what the cool kids are doing these days. Hey, hey. What's man, up? This is my first bowl. Really? Wait, do you like post these like the next day or like post them like boom, 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 like right? All right, man, how do you feel? Trump has won Texas. I was hoping Gary Johnson would win Texas. So, I knew if he go to Trump anyway. I think everybody knew he wasn't going to win. Yeah. Like before Trump won. Stop. What's up? Captain America. Come on. Come on, Cap. Come on! Come on! I'm trying to help you. Hello, what's your name? I'm Chrissy. Hi, Chrissy. How are you? Who did you vote for? Uh, my mom voted for Hillary Clinton because she didn't know that she, uh, Hillary Clinton got, um, killed babies. So, are you going to stay the night for the summer party? You stay for the summer party? Yeah, I don't know if the drama's going to be awesome. Jennifer and Andrea were in the same outfit today. Uh, nobody won yet. They don't like uncertainty. Uh, uh, and this is uncertainty. Uh, well, it's also shock. This is a lot of things kind of linked to our business. The prognosticators are among us who got involved in that. But this is not expected at all. Because we got big crowds. Andrew, why don't you put it over here? Matthew's just saying that being out for us feels like it just takes forever. The party is winding down. We have Andrea, Brenda, Bo, and Matthew left. The kids have gone to bed. Except this little party animal. Wow! Trump got Florida! 49%. Let's be fun right now. We gotta help him. What do you think of that, Matt? How are you feeling? Uh, excited, <laughs> shocked, surprised. Excited? I don't know. Excited. Bo, you're disappointed? <laughs> or just like just amazed? Because you said he wasn't going to win. Bamboozled. Bamboozled? Yeah. How you guys feeling over here? Yeah, Robert Robert Marie, Marie, kick him in the knee. <laughs> <laughs> We're thinking about doing the mannequin challenge when Trump won, but he still hasn't won. I don't think we're going to know for sure until tomorrow. Everybody's passing out. <laughs> Even Bo, he fell asleep on the bench over there. <laughs> it's crazy, but looks like Trump won. Pretty nuts, right guys? Nobody saw that coming. Trump will be the 45th president of the United States, winning the most unreal, wow. surreal, <laughs> unbelievable. Where's everybody going? Comment of the day. Wait, I first want to say Nia planned a really fun party. He did such a good job Aww, keeping thanks. things fun. When things got boring, people just got up and did some pictures over there at the little photo booth. And um, went around the kitchen ate. It was really fun. We had a great time. Aww. You did a good job. It was so fun. Thank you. It was so fun seeing that our house can accommodate people. Comment of the day. Goes to Galaxy Girl Gamer 578. In the beginning, Juliet had Trump hair. LOL. Hashtag go Trump. Mm, she <laughs> she totally does Trump sometimes. Hair. It's like that. I can't believe that it like pick up on that. A boy at Symphony School dressed up as Donald Trump for America Day. I don't know why American Day. I was like, oh, obviously. Because the election is the next day. Well, no, they have it's Spirit Week. Like today was Spirit Day. That's why she's wearing green and white. Oh, okay. Tomorrow's, what's it called? Copycat Day. What do you guys think? Did it turn out the way you wanted it to turn out? Yeah, let us know in the comments below. There's one thing you guys know we're happy about that Donald Trump said he was going to elect Supreme Court justices who were pro life. And that's one thing we're excited about. Yeah. So, hopefully that will really happen. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Don't forget. We love you. And, and remember, remember to, to love, love each, each other. other.